Hey, I'm Major League Fishing Select Angler Ot Defoe. Now I want to talk to you about fishing a small topwater bait on a spinning rod setup. You know, most guys, whenever they're fishing topwater, they're going to be throwing it on a bait caster. And I do too, the majority of the time when I'm fishing a full size topwater bait. But in Major League Fishing, it's all about catching a lot of fish and catching just those scoreable bass. You know, it's not a regular tournament where we just need the five biggest ones. So a small topwater bait can be a great way to get a lot of numbers on the board and add up and tally up a lot of weight really quick. But to fish a bait like this effectively, you have to pick your setup. And for me, that's gonna be a spinning rod, a six and a half to seven foot long medium action spinning rod, a good quality spinning reel, like a size 30, size 35 spinning reel is, is really important. And monofilament line, usually eight pound test monofilament line is what I like. You can fish these on braid at times, but that braid with no stretch can really just overpower this bait. You know, any small topwater bait, whether it's a popper style bait or a walking bait, it can be really easy to overpower it with braid with no stretch. So monofilament is definitely the way to go. But these baits are extremely effective to get a lot of bites. You have to use this spinning rod to be efficient. As a tournament angler, the more good cast I make in a day, the more fish I'm likely to catch. And the more fish I'm likely to catch, the higher up on the score tracker I'm gonna be. So be sure the next time you're wanting to fish a small topwater bait, put it on a spinning rod.